Uh, I am actually a classical liberal. I believe in equal opportunity, but I don't like identity politics and I don't like divisive conflicts. They're not necessary and they're not productive. So as a philosopher, I have a duty to speak my mind and, 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 to, and to reflect on these issues. So it, it happens that the publishing industry is not totally, but very largely controlled. They have a lot of censorship in the publishing industry. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? I, I, I self-published a novel in 1994, which has been compared to works by George Orwell, Aldous Huxley, and Kurt Vonnegut, and it has never seen the light of day in mainstream publishing. I sold 2,000 copies underground from a post office box in Vancouver. That was my first book, okay? Because no literary agent would touch it. I got letters from literary agents saying, if we represent this book, it'll be the end of our career. What is the book so, so dangerous for? It's a satire on political correctness. I'll give you the, the irony that now, fast forward 30 years later, I'm still writing books that are popular, but the publishing industry is, is very, let us say, ideological, and they will promote books that agree with their ideology, and they will tend these days especially to cancel contracts or simply to suppress books that don't agree with their ideology.